The Cobra Effect, a term coined from a historical event in colonial India, serves as a stark reminder of the unforeseen and often counterproductive consequences that can result from well-intentioned policies. It is a phenomenon where the solution to a problem ends up exacerbating it. Let's explore this fascinating historical example, along with other real-world instances of the Cobra Effect. In colonial India, the British government, alarmed by the number of venomous cobras in Delhi, sought to reduce the snake population. To achieve this, they introduced a bounty program that rewarded individuals for each dead cobra they turned in. On the surface, it seemed like a logical solution to a pressing problem. However, the unintended consequence was that enterprising individuals began breeding cobras to claim the bounties, exacerbating the cobra problem rather than solving it. This episode in India's history serves as a quintessential illustration of the cobra effect and the idea that even well-intentioned policies can have unexpected and adverse outcomes. Prohibition in the United States, 1920 to 1933. Prohibition, the nationwide ban on the sale, production, and transportation of alcohol, was intended to reduce alcohol consumption and its associated problems. However, this well-intentioned policy had unintended consequences. The rise of illegal speakeasies and bootlegging operations thrived during this period, turning ordinary citizens into criminals. Organized crime syndicates seized the opportunity, creating a vast network of illegal alcohol production and distribution. Furthermore, the consumption of dangerous, unregulated alcoholic beverages spiked, leading to health risks and even fatalities. What started as a well-intentioned effort to promote temperance ended up fostering a culture of lawlessness, violence, and excessive drinking. Tax breaks for SUVs in the US. Tax incentives intended to support American farmers by making trucks more affordable inadvertently made SUVs, classified as trucks, more popular. This shift in consumer preferences increased oil consumption and emissions, contradicting the intention to reduce the environmental footprint. The well-intentioned plan to boost the agricultural sector indirectly contributed to environmental challenges. Window tax. The window tax in Britain, imposed in the 18th and 19th centuries, serves as a classic example of the Cobra effect. This tax was levied based on the number of windows a house had. While it was intended to generate revenue for the government, the unintended consequence was that homeowners bricked up or blocked their windows to reduce their tax liability. This maneuver not only decreased the tax collected, but also led to darker, less ventilated, and unhealthier homes. The very policy meant to bolster government coffers resulted in reduced quality of life for the citizens. Rat bounty in French colonial Hanoi. To eradicate rats, the French colonial authorities offered a bounty for rat tails. However, instead of killing rats, people began cutting off tails and releasing the rats to breed, ensuring a continuous supply of tails. This bounty system unintentionally fueled the rat population, making the problem worse rather than better. The Indian Claims Commission, ICC. The ICC was established to adjudicate the claims of Native Americans against the United States, addressing historical injustices. However, it led to the Cobra Effect, where some individuals married Native American women to gain access to their tribe's land claims. Once the claims were settled, these individuals often divorced or even murdered their spouses to collect the government money for themselves. The ICC's intention to address historical injustices inadvertently created new ones, highlighting the complexity of rectifying historical wrongs.